my artist review of uh, Tara Donovan. Should we get started? Let's get started. I like it. Okay. So Tara Donovan's medium is everyday objects. In this case, she made this piece out of paper plates and hot glue. Um, most of her works remain untitled. I like to think that she uh, would prefer for the viewer to make their own um, interpretations of her work rather than uh, defining that for them. Um, she's also stated that she doesn't intend to make environmental statements um, with the use of these material themselves. Um, so that's kind of different than other artists who may use uh, disposable materials um, like she does. Um, this one's pretty interesting. I think these these shapes in here are pretty miraculous. So um, She has chosen everyday objects because they are easily accessible in large quantities. So again, she does not intend to make environmental statements with the use of her materials. Um, which is interesting. She uh, also once said in an interview that inspiration is a joke. Real artists sit down and work. Um, I think that's so fascinating and you can see in her artworks that um, she has a, a lot of um, repetition, a lot of um, kind of the nitty gritty parts of art that um, many of us might not want to do. Um, I can't imagine stacking all of these cups up. <laughs> um, I really enjoy the kind of undulating movement that is in these these cups here. I think that's pretty cool. Um, this piece is made out of uh, like acrylic straw like um, things. Um, so that's pretty creative. She said that um, she likes this um, material because it creates a dynamic lighting effect. You can kind of see that some parts the light comes through, other parts it's really dark. So that's pretty interesting. Um, she also said, um, somebody said about Tara um, in an interview that she's using one thing over and over and over again. And instead of getting repetition and predictability, you get something completely unfamiliar. Um, I think that's pretty interesting. I would never imagine um, to use acrylic straws this way. So I think it's pretty magical what she can come up with. This is one of my favorite pieces. This is made um, entirely out of shattered panes of glass. So she basically builds a wooden frame, stacks up these pieces of glass, and then shatters them one by one, um, starting with the bottom piece, just works her way up the stack. And then when they're all shattered, she takes off the wooden frame and they're good to go. So that's pretty interesting. I think, uh, I think it's pretty cool. She also says that sometimes um, if like in a showing or anything, if somebody bumps into it, they have to completely remake the piece. Um, and also, this is my favorite part. When the show is finished, the piece, piece gets taken away with shovels. I think that's pretty interesting. So they, they have to remake this every time they show it. Um, this is made entirely out of slinkies. Um, so Tara, it's been said uh, in one of my resources that uh, Tara multiplies everyday materials to explore the transformative effects of accumulation and aggregation. Um, so yeah, I think it's all just very, very interesting. This, um, I think, is one of her more famous works. It's made entirely out of styrofoam cups. Um, uh, a little bit towards her process, Tara works uh, backwards from what we would consider standard for how artists create their pieces. So um, first she picks her material. Um, so in this case, she would have picked styrofoam cups. What can I make out of styrofoam cups? And then using the material, she comes up with the concept. So um, most artists, I would say, use the concept first and think about what materials can help them achieve that. Tara Donovan works backwards, so she picks the materials first. Um, this one, along with many of her other installations, is built specially for this room. Um, if she were to move galleries, she would take it down, rebuild it, or take off some pieces, add some pieces, whatever, to make it fit the space perfectly. This is so interesting. This is um, Tara Donovan's first NFT project called Quarty. 
Um, the series is comprised of 500 unique works um, or NFTs. This is one of them. Um, so they contain what, what they are is a single repeating letter or symbol. So in this case, it looks like there's a Y is the single repeating letter or symbol. Um, I've seen some of them um, that look really cool with the letter C or like a question mark. It's pretty remarkable what she can do for this. Um, also interesting, Donovan is donating 25% of the proceeds for this project to Planned Parenthood. Um, this is one of her titled works called Transplanted. This is um, made up of ripped brown paper. Um, and it kind of reminds me of a, a mountainous landscape. So uh, it's pretty, pretty interesting and kind of an imposing shape in this big room. Um, it was featured in Donovan's exhibit Fieldwork, which was showcased in 2019 in the Museum of Contemporary Art in Denver. And I believe that's it. So that is kind of an overview of um, Tara Donovan's work. You've seen some of them. Um, really, her, her whole stance is creating something new out of objects that are repeating and that you would not predict. So everyday objects repetition and uh, aggregation. So she really creates these super beautiful undulating and kind of imposing um, works of art that are really interesting to look at. So yeah, thank you for joining me.